Hi, I'm Joshua with Spirit Magi. I want to talk to you guys about the path I have trod. It's the things that I've done to get to where I'm at now. Learn, know, and be wise. It says, I hope you Norse runes teachings. The fifth world of the Hopi, songs of the runes. In our grandmother's words, our collective grandmother, this is where you could start at to learn about the truth of this realm, the true language of love and light, the original language of this realm, is the Futhark runes. And my Hopi teacher, the Hopi elders and their knowledge, and in Norse and their knowledge, bring the red and the white together and you learn about the runes so each rune is an elder round the thrones were 24 thrones and seated on the thrones were 24 elders clad in white garments with golden crowns upon their heads each of these is a being incarnated in this realm now each of these is a star there are two signs per zodiac sign per astrological sign those are the 12 tribes, the 12 constellations. There's a 13th one too, the Lost Tribe. This is part of the 144,000 that's spoken of in Revelation. The video playlist is there with 33 videos, complete with the Hopi prophecies spoken of by Thomas Banyaka Jr. and Sr. at the end of the playlist after the runes teachings. Kriya Yoga and Breathwork is a, what I've learned from Master Imram and from Yogananda and other various Vedic teachers. And you sit and you breathe and you make DMT in your pineal gland and you meet God. You see God's face with your eyes closed. Like they said, like Jacob said, did at the place called Pineal. He saw God's face, face to face, and yet he was spared. That's what they're talking about. So you can come here and learn more about this. Master Imram has got all the deets. You go read his page. Check him out on social media. Watch his videos. That dude is lit. He's like fire. I, I, I don't know anybody else that just popped my noodle more than that dude. All right, so the diet changed to hemp milk. I quit eating food. I started eating just hemp milk. I eat some fruits and nuts here, a salad occasionally, but I just have hemp milk every day or hemp smoothies with fruit in it every day. It contains three grams of omega-3 fatty acids and nine grams of omega-6. This is a full amino acid profile. So if you look down here, 11 grams of protein is in one cup. That's like one scoop of hemp hearts. I put three of them in three cups and drink it. I do two of those a day. That's 60 grams of protein in a full amino acid profile. Oh, I need to fix that. You can watch these videos down here. These links are to Amazon so that you can purchase the products. I'm not affiliated or anything. It's just to give y'all some links. This is getting into the pineal detox, which the hemp milk helped me do a lot of detoxing. Kundalini is the spirit fire that moves through the sixth ventricle of the spinal column. As its name signifies, the pineal gland is a sacred pine cone in the brain, the single eye, which cannot be opened until the spirit fire, Kundalini, Chi, Prana, Holy Spirit, or Holy Ghost, etc., is raised through the sacred seals, which are called the seven churches of Asia, mainly P. Hall. You can see spiritmagi.com slash audiobooks and have all of his lectures, Alan Watts, and many others available for free to listen to. And then this is the advanced mechanics, biological, biophysical, metaphysical mechanics of the pineal gland video, which is derived from the book Becoming Supernatural by Joe Dispenza. You can watch that on YouTube on the audiobook. Fasting, as Jesus said, Yeshua said, Hi, I'm Joshua. You will not find the kingdom of my father unless you fast from this world. Unless you fast from the sins that these invaders have put on the table for us to eat. We shouldn't be eating none of the things they're trying to feed us. 
yet most people do. And the fasting takes you to Dr. Pradeep, he's brilliant, and this gives you the left brain side of fasting. I'm going to integrate the website a little more and have some right brain fasting. I don't have a fasting page yet. We'll get there. Yogananda wrote the book Autobiography of a Yogi, which this is the audio books you can listen to for free, all these videos in here. And, um, these are his audio books and some other uh, audio files you can listen to. These are all of his books that he's ever published, just about. The second coming of Christ. We're it. The Rainbow Warriors. And so I was watching Master Imram and he suggested this book and I read it and it changed my life. You should do it. Autobiography of a Yogi. And then there's more free resources listed out on the website. Knowledge is power. Loading the Great Awakening. And this is kind of lists out all the stuff that's on the website. You can go take a look at that there. It's also uh, easy to get to at spiritmagi.com slash library. And then there's a blog where I put things that are cool and fun to read about. Like, you know, blog stuff. Native prophecies. The legend of the Ketoas. Hemp does literally everything. It does. The prophecy of the seven fires of the Ashinabi. We just lit the eighth fire too. Legend of the white buffalo woman. Look, they got three pages. I ain't know I did that much stuff on here. I ain't do none of it. God did all that. Magic shrooms. Look at that guy. Who is that? Yeshua with a bunch of mushrooms. You already know. Sound of freedom. Save the babies. I'm yeah. I'm not gonna say what's gonna happen to the bad guys, but tick tock, tick tock. We got a wrong calendar. These invaders done dicked up everything. Excuse my language. And uh, but they did. And so our calendar is supposed to have 13 months with 28 days, so it'd be locked in with the lunar cycle and it would be natural. They don't like natural. The invaders are satanic, so they do everything backwards and opposite. They're just holy and divine. We don't like that. See Jesus Revolution, the prophecy of the Andes Caros. They say when the fifth level seeds sprout within humanity and form a whole, we're going to take back over. Rainbow Warriors. They did poison our world. I don't even like them. But it's okay. Because the sacred masculines is rising and the Rainbow Warriors is here. 144,000 of them on the dot. Red Kachina, Blue Kachina. One Kachina, two Kachina. What y'all know about that? This ain't magic mushrooms. This regular mushrooms over there. And, uh, you know, so spiritmagi.com. This is the path I have tried. I'm still trying it. I ain't fixed all the way. I'm doing pretty good though. <laughs> I think. So I want y'all to do good with me. To be good people. That's what Hopi means. Hopi means good people. So anybody could be Hopi. You don't have to be native or in a certain tribe. You just choose to be good. To be loved. To share love, knowledge, wisdom, truth, to plant seeds, grow food, and feed children, to sing and dance, be joyous, and love all. That's as easy as it's supposed to be. Life really is simple. All this other extra stuff is extra AF. I'm glad I got to talk to y'all for a minute and show you some things. I love you all. God bless the children. Peace to the elders. Peace to the ancestors. Peace to the gods. Glory to the high one. God bless you and yours. I love you. But only for forever and a half though. <laughs> That's a pretty long time, ain't it? Eee!